Hey, welcome to Transform Through Story and Tarot. It's your girl, Storm Journey, and this is going to be a Manifestation Monday reading, okay? So we're going to see what is manifesting in your life for this week, okay? Today is a full moon. Today is January 17th, 2022, so we're going to jump right into this reading. So it's kind of a bonus, okay? Um, you're getting a full moon manifestation as well as a weekly manifestation. So happy Monday to you all, right? right? Um, and happy King Day as well. So we're going to go ahead and jump right into this reading and see what it is that's manifesting for the week for my collective from now until next Monday. What can my collective expect to see manifest within their life during this time? Okay, let's see what wants to come out. We have letting go. All right, so that's what it is, right? Um, you're definitely releasing some things, okay? Releasing people um, and, and really elevating, really um, seeing what and who needs to be um, removed from your life, right? Um, I feel like these are things and people and places that have harmed you, okay? Um, and you are transcending. Could be family. Um, yeah, could be family with the number six as well. So um, just really transcending, ascending, right? And, and moving forward, right? Um, realizing that whatever pain you have gone through, um, you have also um, learned through as well. So keeping the wisdom, but allowing the pain to uh, subdue, right? To fall wayside and, and never feel that pain again, right? Um, so yeah, releasing some things, letting go. So that's what you can expect um, to manifest in your life um, this week, right? So sorry but not sorry okay people and things will be um will be uh falling off so we're gonna go and use the chakra deck to get a little more clarification on this letting go and what it is that that's being released here so what what can we expect and what area can we expect this letting go, this release? Where can we expect this in our life spirit? Okay. Um how is this affecting us? How is this affecting us? What can we expect from this letting go? What can we expect from releasing? What can we expect from releasing? All right. So the overall energy with this letting go is all about raising your vibration. It's all about yeah being in alignment right and so um this is what you're shedding you're shedding things that are in alignment with your vibration with your frequency okay um so this is this is divine frequency this is master level frequency okay um so yeah letting go of things and people that are of low vibration um what is letting what are you letting go of um i feel like you're letting go of your pride your ego right i feel like you're stepping into a period of 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 self love right loving yourself more so anything that tarnishes your confidence anything that um diminishes or lowers your self-esteem your self-worth i feel like you're getting rid of right um 
And this is happening to help you manifest. This is happening because it is a manifestation. You manifest it to elevate, to ascend, to step into a a more confident place, right? And so in order to do that, in order to to be um, this vibrant energy to co-create, to expand, to grow, to allow your inner child to shine, right? Um, you, you have to, you have to let go of some things and, and, and people, right? Um, and that's what's happening. You're, you're going through a, a new experience here where you're learning visualization. You're learning how to, how to co-create in your mind, how to visualize, right? Your imagination is, is sharpening. And so this is this is what this shift is. And so um, you can expect love coming from this. You can expect to receive love as well as to give love, right? You can expect a, a more healed space um, within your own heart, right? Um, and then within your family, right? Or, or what you consider to be be family. So um, I usually do not break down um, the number 33 because it is a master number. But for the sake of this reading, I do have 666 on the board, okay, um, if I was to break that number down, right? Um, but again, with this master number 33, we know that that is the angels coming up and showing up the ascended masters coming up and showing up for you okay so we're going to go ahead and end the reading off right because we know that in order for you to receive love you're going to have to let go of some things that um may be low vibrational may um be low self-esteem or people that may lack confidence within themselves because again, your manifestations are coming into fruition and everybody can't go with you, right? So we have intentions, right? Intention is the creative power that fulfills our dreams. As your will, so is your destiny, right? And again, focusing your intentions on your calling, on your destiny, on where it is that you're going. And that's what's happening here, right? Your vibration is very high. And and as you transcend, the things that you communicate um, may not be receptive, right, because of the frequency uh, mismatch, right? Um, So, yeah, you're going to have to release some things so that you can call in what is vibing on your level, okay? So, that's what I have for you. I hope it resonates. Love and light.